I know both Senator Vitter and Representative Edwards well. Um, they're, the good news is they're both very smart. Neither one of them will steal. Uh, they both want what's best for Louisiana. The problem is that there's a, there's a huge difference between John Bell and David in, in terms of what they think the state needs. Um, you just look at their records. I mean, David is a conservative. John Bell is a liberal. Uh, David uh, supported in the last presidential race Rick Santorum and Mitt Romney. John Bell supported Barack Obama, even nominated him at the convention. Uh, David thinks the problem with the state's finances is too much spending. John Bell thinks the problem is not enough revenue, not enough taxes. Uh, David will fight every day against Obamacare. John Bell supports Obamacare. David supports charter schools. John Bell doesn't. David supports taking over failing schools. John Bell doesn't. David supports school choice. John Bell doesn't. John Bell supports a minimum wage. I think his first day in office, he will raise the minimum wage, which will cost Louisiana thousands of jobs. Uh, David Vitter would never do that. I, I mean, there's just a huge night and day difference in terms of their, their ideology and their political philosophy. And so forget about the Republican Democrat label. Just look at where they stand on the issues. And if I think if you're a conservative and believe that uh, we have too much government in America, you're going to want to support David Bitter. I think if you are a liberal and you believe that uh, government can solve all our problems and, and, and the bureaucrats know better than we do about how to run our own lives, I think you're going to want to support John Bell. Now, to me, the choice is clear. I'm all in with David Vitter, um, but there's a big difference, night and day. Those of you who believe you're too smart to get involved in politics, I understand. But that means you're destined to be governed by people dumber than you are. Go vote. Go vote or don't complain. Go vote.